Asia ni bingele la sanbona Asia ni bingele la sanbo Asia ni bingele la sanbona Asia ni bingele la Oh my God, Sanbona ni tumelang Good day and welcome to TC TV my name is Indomiso Mashangu, and I'm here for yet another episode. I mean, it's a new month. It's September. We're taking new topics. We have different guests, you know. We're mixing things up. As for no one like at a table champ, we want to keep things interesting. Just when you think you've seen it all, see a figure sitting in my Indilanga. That's what we first known for a table champ, which is innovation and transformation. Thank you for taking the time. And the effort to watch me and my guest today in studio. I hope you guys are going to grab a mouthful from today's episode. Every September, Attendance Awareness Month takes place to spread awareness regarding why maintaining attendance in school and college is very essential for your academic success. In today's episode, we draw insight on how absenteeism can negatively affect your business. You know, it's always good to take time out. I mean, a direct selling, if there's one thing I've learned, it's that our table charm family, they work long hours, they attend meetings, they spend hours in the sun selling and recruiting, and we can all agree what a day or two off is essential and necessary just to, to talk more, reflect and see how you can do better. But what we are against the table charm is procrastination you know whenever there's a meeting in your area saying not now i'll attend the next one going goes logo you know not going to a meeting because you're lazy bible going goes logo you know not going to a meeting because it's too hot or too cold hey going goes logo at the end of the day this is your business and today's episode is all about walala wasala don't sleep on your business attendance 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 Today we have a look at how starting your business with the right food and following the right processes helps in building a very healthy and a good business. Namhlanje mbukeni bamuthande kayo estudio angihambi ngedwa niyamazi nosimini hle zingamba namabhoza awusuke emabhozeni. Today I've got two beautiful and bright table charmers. One is a male, yes you've got that right, and the other is a beautiful female. The male goes by the name of Uputi Louis Sitole. And the beautiful lady in studio with me today goes by the name of Ayanda Mube. Welcome, Put Louis, and welcome, sis Ayanda. I am so happy. Thank you. Thank you. Now we know what is courtesy, man. And then in Angosian Villena, a party, be Mali Mali and Ilega bag. So, you taking the time to sit in studio with us today does not go unnoticed. See how we cool. Right. Mbola Molandela, in case you are wondering, Oguti, Oput Louis Itole Obani, Oput Louis Itole has always been a network marketer outside of Table Chub. This lovely gentleman in April 2022, after attending a meeting that was hosted by one of our area managers in Bara, he then decided to take up on the opportunity to sign up with Table Chub. Four months down the line, Oput Louis Itole. The very same guy who joined in April 2022 is now about to become a depot manager. Well done. Halala, put Louis, halala. Halala. <laughs> right. And then the beautiful lady, Usis Ayanda Nube. Oh, guys. It has to be my person and I meant it. I'm a bulldozer. You know what? This lady started a little over a year ago. And a year later, believe me when I say it, she is an executive manager, soon to be distributor, literally 12 months. Ayanda Nube is an executive. Oh, Zegeti. 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 Halala, Zegeti. Halala. Well done. Thank you so much, my, my lovely um, guests today. You know, I know already Ababugele Kaya is so interested to find out how did you guys do it so soon for months? You know, one year, how did you guys do it? So I'm very happy that you guys are willing to share this with our listeners and our beautiful subscribers. Can't wait to get this started. Stay tuned. Tati Dayalapo, take notes, Mbugel, if you want to one day be this. Pasani sit belt. match. According to the Direct Sellings Association, better known as a DSA, 82% of network marketers are women. So, that is, that is a lot. 82%. 
abantu besimane we direct selling and here you are umuntu wesilisa doing the same thing abantu besimane that are doing and you even doing it quicker and somehow better you know um what can you say um attracted you to the industry you know you born in the industry because i see that mean obaba ababa attracted to selling and building a network however you've done it what attracted you to network marketing as a man um for the fact that i'm going to be my i'm going to own my own business yes be a business builder of course um also earning the salary that will be determined by myself oh, it's the power as well as working my own time but that doesn't give me as a business builder mm-hmm. uh, a chance to relax that. it means i need to work as someone who's going to work every day and by so doing i know that um, my business will grow quicker that's what that is well that well that mugelo zwili you know ubutlui uthi just because he was once a business builder he made a decision uthi why table charm i'm going to work as though i've been employed i'm going to work my business every single day like a full time employee Yes, well done to you. Well done. Thank you so much for that question. I've got another question for you, Budwami. I mean, um, you joined Table Charm in April after attending a meeting at Barakut. That was a few months ago. And I'm sure before you took the decision, I think in Naiham, you had expectations because I've already mentioned how you've always been in network marketing. And then you heard about Table Charm Direct. I'm sure you had expectations which were evoked maybe by the stories of oh, those is really like a table chap who can't even know about willing daily or can't go to my zusa by joining and then you joined four months later you are on your way to becoming a depot manager would you know about willing daily whatever level we expect here would you say that table chap has met your expectations or even better would you say table chap has exceeded what you were expecting to do yes eh uh, engibonile kukhona aba bekhuluma ngapho la mhm bebakhuluma ngeindlela zokukhula of course ku table jam mhm siyaqala singama preferred shoppers yes uh, whereby we come in and we buy and the amount that we want to buy with the aim of getting interest mhm but mm-hmm. then uh, i just passed that one You passed that one. Yes. Now coming to a business, business builder. builder. Mm. They said to me I need to recruit one person. Of course. And then I will end rebates. Ah. Ala so ala. One person. And then I end rebates. And end rebates. Nice. Okay. Instead of recruiting one. Mm. My first time I recruited five. Mm. And then I understood the steps. Of course. to grow of course being a business builder going to a bronze business builder mm-hmm. going to silver. a silver business builder yes. a gold business builder network and then a network manager now i was looking to be a depot manager okay nice yes nice. Uh, because uh, they i have heard that they said get ten people Yes but make them also have their, their own generations their yes. Tens. yes so i said that is possible nice and 10 people is not 10 people is not I've, i've always been on stage yes so in less than a week i got more than 10 people yes. and uh, my first time mm. uh my first month I've earned 500 plus rebate rebate oh, I'm sorry it was 200 plus rebate mm. rebate yes. you know you know but Louis, I always say he rebate the yes. money that we pay our people for banking on time no matter how small it is 
the fact that it's money oh, it's wena. I mean yes. there's not a single person who can just throw you with 200 mm. in the face and say oh, you are pretty today you know it doesn't happen you know so the fact that you sold you got your retail profit from what you sold you went on and banked and after banking table chamati thank you nine two hundred I mean yes and uh, to elaborate on that yes I love it my second month I got five hundred and fifty plus so you that managed to double rebate. your rebate I managed to double again I last call oh, yes, yes. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, my third month, mm-hmm. it was 1,995. Well done. Yes. Well done. So, going back to my question, my expectations. Yes. From everything that you've said, I can pick up. What was really going on? What was really going on? Yeah. You were expecting much. I expected it because I needed that financial freedom. Of course. Yes. And in three months, besides the commission, you were able to make an extra thousand just for banking. Exactly. So definitely table chomp did with your expectations. Exactly. Well done. Thank you so much. Budiluyo, I'm enjoying this so much. Let's move now to the lovely lady, Usis Ayanda. Sis Ayanda, are you sure it's only been a year? <laughs> just I, I just, 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 just I'm just making sure. I just did. Because Pelago race and was like, it, it really happens. I mean, for a person to join table chomp and then 12 months down the line, they are on their way knocking. We distribute television. We say, Coco, Fulan, how did you do it, Sis Ayanda? I mean, what did you do to get closer to your goals? I mean, you did more right than wrong for you to be where you are today. There's people watching you today. I wish I was an executive manager now. I wish I could also hit the levels in 12 months. What would you say are the strategies that you've used, Sis Ayanda? I mean, isn't it right? What did you implement that got you to the level of being an executive manager at Table Job? Thank you for that question. I think in the beginning, it was me understanding that what you reap is what you sow. If you can't be faithful on the little, then you can't be trusted with big. So it had to start as a business builder, understanding that Mm. admin is the whatever store comes to, I'm trusted with, I need to make sure that. I know it to the T. Who am I involved? Who am I giving to? Yes. Who is my customer? Who's supposed to pay me? So then we were then introduced to the U2 Me Too, which ah. means teach two, find two, teach two. two. Yes. So I had to make sure that I get my into just like what Louis was saying. Yes. You go out there, you are recruiting. But I also had to understand that not everyone you recruit is going to be active. And not everyone you recruit is going to come and meet your expectations. Of course. So which means keep on recruiting. Keep on recruiting. Keep on recruiting. We talk of, of duplicating, which means you find your own copy. You find someone who's going to work as hard as you. So you can't find them if you only have two. You just have to keep going. Then introduce them at 10, 10 meaning the 10 people that you're getting, you teach them. Also so teaching is, teaching is big because no one can do it without knowledge. You need to be knowledgeable at the end of the day. I bow to have knowledge. <laughs> I bow. You are so well spoken. Thank you. I'm blown away. I got the table champ, no shame. I know. Just because we are selling and recruiting, no one's playing up the Sekaya's food deal. And now, what's a job? I'm Ayad. I have been who keep this news. We have keeper. We have keeper. Well done, Sis Ayad. Thank you. You know, I've, I've heard of the strategy that's also worked for a lot of people to get somewhere quicker. You door to door. I'm a lady, I'm very skeptical when it comes to door to door because when I'm at home, to go and knock on doors and say, Coco, Nali Tuba, Sia Kasha, Sia Tengisa, Sia Lapa. Would you say, as Umam Ayanda, you've tried using it to do and it hasn't helped you get to where you are at this um, pace? At this point, I think 
I would like to say that is the only way, if if I can be honest, because so it's not going to change. Money is where the people are. I I know. Know. So if I you're not, if you're not recruiting, which means you are not going to be a manager, which means you're not going to be getting the rebates that people are really yes, talking about. No, no, no. So when I started, I I think my mother was my first consultant. Love that. I had to understand. You start within. Charity begins, begins at home. So we just had to go door by door. Imagine you're going out with a catalog. You don't even have a product in the end, in the end, but you're saying, I believe in table charm. I'm selling table charm. Here's my catalog. You can go through it. You can choose what you want to buy, or you can join me in selling. That's how we grew. She then became my first manager and Hi Bo, hi Bo, hi Bo, hi Bo, hi Bo. Your mother, yes. your first yes. manager, yes. legacy. We keep going. We keep going. Love that. Well yes. done. You know what? You guys are powerful. I must admit you guys are powerful. If Table Charm keeps on attracting people of your caliber, listen, the future is bright. Mm. The future is so bright. Our field is in good hands. I'm so mm. proud of you guys. Those were exceptional answers. And like a nice team. Well done, Sis Ayan. Thank you. I mean, with every good thing that happens, there's a few bad things that happen. However, we always encourage remaining positive, staying hungry, mm-hmm. not focusing on things that you cannot change, not focusing on the bad things that happen. Bad things will always happen to you. Mm-hmm. What matters is how you react to them, you know, mm-hmm. and how you keep mm-hmm. your mind positive. Yes. I mean, you've mentioned all these amazing strategies that you've actually implemented to be this executive manager. On the flip side, this I had, I mean, it put talents well wound. Mm. Mistakes are made by human beings, and we're all human beings. Mm. I'm sure on your journey to becoming a distributor or an executive manager, you've done a few mistakes. You know, sometimes you make a mistake, you know, and you learn after, and then you're like, Ish, I didn't know. I would have. You know? So, Mm. are there some of the things that you didn't know, maybe, that came and bit you, Nyana, but somehow you were like, Ish, I wish I knew, but today you know. If they are, what are they? So that if someone at home wants to start, can look out for those and not make the same mistake who I underdid. Yes. Uh, I think what really took a knock on, on my business for me mm-hmm. was the recruiting part of it. Uh-huh. Where you recruit, like they're saying, you two, me too. You, and too, me too. you go and yeah. run, you get the two people. You're thinking, yeah, I'm saying cool. it right. to me right. Mm. But they don't meet your expectations, which mm. means your growth now it's stagnant. You're not just grow, growing as much as you'd like. Yes. So I had to understand that even if you recruit the two, even if you recruit the ten, yes. it doesn't stop. Whether you're a distributor or you're an executive manager or you're a business builder, even if you have 20 people, you have to keep on recruiting. Oh. Because like I said in the beginning, it's not everyone who's going to be active. That's the nice. unfortunate part. But you have to keep on recruiting and keep on going. So you can't relax. Yes, I know the two days, like you're saying, you need them to, to rest and gain more strength. But keep on going. Keep, keep on, on going. Keep That's on the only going. way you can grow. Love that. Mm. Love that. I think one thing you've touched on is a mistake is that you set a target. Okay. Mm. Table Chan said you two, me too. Each two, find two, teach, teach two. two. Mm. And then our people go and find the two. And then they clap hands and their yes. legs have yes. arrived. Have and arrived. now you are waiting for mm-hmm. orders. Mm-hmm. You are waiting for the two to bear fruits. Yeah. And yeah. when they don't bear fruits, obviously you are stagnant. Mm-hmm. So what you've actually touched on is the power of consistency. Mm-hmm. There is power mm-hmm. in doing something over mm-hmm. and over mm-hmm. and over again. You don't stop hunting when you mm-hmm. get what you are hunting for. The minute you get what you are hunting for, you, you look for something next. else. Yeah. On to the next. Yeah. Well done. True. Well done, Sis Ayala. I love that. This is really Makai. No time to rest. Keep on keeping on. That's how you want to view Sis Ayala Nube or Uput Louis Sitole. Right, we're moving on to the next question. Are there any myths, and this question is for the both of you, because both of you have a certain amount of experience mm-hmm. in the business. I mean, are there any myths in Zulu, I think it is on Inganiwane, or stereotypes, um, or self-limiting beliefs, you know? Enwaziyo, or Enkule Akulunwa, wherever you come from, which you guys would like to eliminate, you know? Ogutia this is not possible because of one, two, three. But Nina have managed to do it. 
Noma be ikoni one, two, three. And because I've managed to do it, I believe that everyone else can. What myths would you tell um, but we see Tolly, Okule Akona about business, self limiting beliefs, Abandu, Abazi show you as negative Nabo. Would you like to eliminate when I would not be Nani Gabanga so, but four months later, I'm thinking a different way because I didn't let those beliefs control me or limit me. Um, especially for this list, guide to a Uma Pete catalog, um, this list. <laughs> Even when you try to recruit a male, uh, only few they attend to your call. Most they will tell you, I need this for my wife. So I think not to come in. Yes. Uh, we believe that we will be able to attract more make mm. into the industry. Of course. To show them that no, it's not only women. Of course. Because <laughs> Yes. So if we can try to eliminate that, Love that, love that. In Muti, in Jela, a table chap or any other direct selling company in Jela, a map. Who put Louis Tolly and Bugelman, what I bow? Nabo Baba, by I hunger, Lentilla, yo, yo, Lentilla, yo, 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 was a sambe machama, was a sambe machama, was a sambe machama, was a aibo. <laughs> Guys, God has answered my prayers. I've always been praying, God, can I at least have someone who can sing in studio because I'm a singer. And Uba Blue, we ain't. He's giving you bass. Who's a man? Thank you so much for that, Blue. I'd like now to hear from the lovely, well-spoken lady. Mrs. Ayanda. Yes. What would you like to eliminate? Operation elimination. Yes. What would you say you'd like to eliminate? I think on the on the business side of it. Yes. Celebrity. We are in charge. You. You are known in charge. You are born as in charge. I was a cool man. I got a in I got two people in. We are so weird. I think that is the biggest one that is limiting a lot of people because a wing in clan, your hard work can get you there. Yes, you might not know how to articulate everything or how to say course, it, but you'll learn, you will learn and you'll get there. So we need Jay from the back of your mind, throw it away. A wing in clan, it's not like we were born with it. No. You know, we, we knew how to say or to sell or to, to talk from the beginning. No. So that one is a big one. I think when it comes to, to table charm, I would like to say to the business builders, forget the mentality that you are working for the manager. Because business no, builders no. will think, no. that is a big one that limits a lot of business builders because you are not working in your full power. Of course. Because at the back of your mind, you are thinking, but uh, she's the one who's getting the money. Oh my Either God. way. Mm-hmm. Like for my case, the person who recruited me is mm-hmm. in the prefectural. So please say that again. Can, the person camera, important. please. Uh, <laughs> camera important. Camera, please zoom into that. I need everyone at home to listen carefully. Go to sis Aya na uti lo muto. I'm recruiting lo bani. No uti uhi today. Just to say it clearly, so that yes. everyone understands, mm. the person who recruited me paid a visit uh, in the building where I was staying mm. in a twin table chair. Yes, she's a preferred show party today. And I'm not sure where she is exactly in an executive manager. <laughs> so <laughs> I need everyone to understand that nice. you're not working for your manager. Nice. Whatever you are putting in, it will come back to you. Nice. Work hard and you'll come back. Love that. I've always, always wanted and hoped 
Uguti, because we say it when we are training. Mm-hmm. Uguti, mm-hmm. it's not push push a table no. mm-hmm. You can be recruited by someone, but because of him seven ziako, ukiti me umshi yenge mirva. You know, but because it comes from us. Um, the table charm family does not believe it's true. So I thank God that today it comes from the horse's mouth. Uguti, I myself, as an executive manager, was recruited by someone who is today a preferred shopper, and I am on my way to a distributor level. Beautiful. Love that. Thank you so much, sis Ayanda. Thank you. you guys are an amazing bunch of kids. I can't. <laughs> <laughs> thank you so much. And before we close, of course, just one question. One question before Svalisa Babugele Kai. I mean, there's someone maybe or Kutibizolo or last week or someone with Hele Kaya, they've got nothing to do. They're stranded. Um, they know they need money. Everything is expensive. And because of your stories, your touching stories, they are ready to get started, you know. Um, what is your message to anyone at home? I mean, both of you were once business builders. And now you guys are at a higher level, making more money. Anyone watching at home who would also like to just get started, you know, you've just pushed them to start. What would you say? Um, I would say that Umbugele Ekaya, who is thinking of building a business within Table Charm Direct. Let me start by addressing the business builders. No work, no pay. Yes. So, if you want to move on, you better keep on keeping mm. on. Keep on keeping on. Love people. Yes. Stay humble. Love that. Have a teachable heart. Beautiful. More especially when a business builder invites a, con- a new consultant. Mm-hmm. We also as consultant, inform the new consultants yes. that there's a business builder guide yes. that they need to get for themselves. Don't run away from that step one. Love that. Get a business builder pack because in a business builder pack has got Beautiful. everything that you need Beautiful. as a future business builder. Mm. Mm. You've got a business builder guide yes. where it will tell you everything that we are saying now. Of course. It's in the business everything builder guide. Mm-hmm. So that will give you an edge to move forward. Mm. Mm. Thank you. Love that. Love that, love that, love that. But Louis, you just touched on the importance of literature, your business mm-hmm. literature. When we started this episode, September is um, Attendance Awareness Month, you mm-hmm. know, and we touched on how it's all about reminding um, school goers and students of how absenteeism can affect their success academically in a negative way. And now you've just touched on some absenteeism, you know, absenteeism of literature, mm-hmm. That's absenteeism of knowledge, you know? Yes. But you need to know what it is. And you can't just, those things don't fall from trees. You need to invest in the necessary literature so that you are aware. Where are you going to have to spend money to make money? You know, you can't hop on a vehicle. After hopping on the vehicle, acquire the necessary Books, which is the business builder guide. It's our table charm Bible. Everything that you will be hearing at meetings is in your table charm Bible. So never ever slip on yourself. As soon as you get started, get that Bible and get your business going and growing. Thank you so much, Kukui. Sisi, I'm going to pose your question in a different light. Okay. We're talking about how we could encourage anyone sitting at home mm-hmm. to get started. Sis Ayana, you told me that you were once a manager. At Romans Peter. I mean, what if there's someone watching today who's also a manager somewhere <laughs> and maybe earning small money, you know? Yes. You decided to leave mm-hmm. Romans Peter because I don't know for whatever reasons, but mm-hmm. what would you say to someone at home? You know, what would you say to them? Should they, is it worth it to leave Vitoho and join Table Cham? What would you say? I mean, what would you say to them? I'd like to say that Table Cham 
we love Table Charm because we are building legacies. Mm -hmm. Meaning, I have my three babies. Anything can happen to me today. Of course, God only knows anything can happen. But I have I have the peace of knowing that anything that happens to me, my children still have something that is going to fend for them. Mm -hmm. But if I, I stayed there, I would have continued working on someone else's dream. Mm -hmm. I would have continued funding someone else's life. Mm -hmm. But today, I am able to work hard mm -hmm. and know that whatever energy I'm putting. I'll benefit. My children will benefit. Wow. So you need to know that whatever you are doing, it needs to come back to you. Love that. You might not live it today, but it's worth thinking about. It's worth talking about. It's worth discussing in your family that if it were to happen, it would be something that will benefit you guys. And I can definitely say Table Sham will benefit you. Ah, well done. Mm -hmm. Well done. This is Ayanda Uti. Ulala and Abtula is really knowing that she's building something every day. The blood, the sweat, everything is worth it because it's not for someone else, but it's for her and her children. One day when she's no longer able to fend for them, they can take over this legacy. I always say that um, a job is temporary, but business is forever. And on that note, since she alabu babu yele makai, Sis Ayanda, yeah. thank you so much for taking the time to join me. But no, I understand you will be attending my training very soon <laughs> as a new manager. Thank God I'm going to have a bass singer in my classroom because I've seen a lot of play and training. <laughs> Sis Ayanda, all the best to Sama Sami. Um, looking forward to seeing you at Night of the Stars next year, Jen, because you are a soon to be distributor. Listen, I hope that night evening gown is, is ready and you are ready to work on the red carpet and accept all your checks because you've worked so damn hard. Yes. That was our episode for today. Thank you for taking the time. I hope you guys have been inspired because I myself am so inspired and I'm just so excited to see what this episode is going to do to people that we're watching at home. We cannot wait to see the fruits of the um, seeds that these two lovely table chambers have, have planted in the studio today. Thank you for watching. Till next time. It's your girl, Dumiso Mashamu. What are you doing in Shia Babugel Bama Batande? You know, Muzo or Wod. Muge, we want the table chamber. Isa, Amanda. <laughs>